Hi guys, it's Dana from RescueDogTreats.com and I'm here to do a Trifecta Plus update and show you what's going on with the plants and show you how I'm going to transplant them. Um, today we are going to transplant the melon plants, the Tigger Tiger melons, and they're looking very good. This one is just a regular no Trifecta Plus or C90. This is a C90. And this is a Trifecta Plus melon. And a regular melon. Trifecta Plus. And C90. And I have to say right now they're all looking about the same but it's time for them to get some full sunshine. Uh, it's 85 degrees today here in the Sacramento Valley. So let me show you how we're going to ensure that the experiment is complete. So I've got three of the Groham's boxes, self-watering. And we have two plants each for the Trifecta Plus, the C90, and then just regular compost tea, nothing else added. So what we're going to do is put each two in one of the grow boxes. These are self-watering Groham's grow boxes. And to make sure that they all start out the same, we're going to mix up some compost, uh, the wicking material, which is the coconut core, rock dust, and some potting soil. Mix that all together and then fill up the boxes uh, exactly the same. Then when we plant them, I will put in the Trifecta Plus with the Trifecta Plus group and then water with the C90 in the C90 group. So that's what's going to happen. So let's get to it. Okay, so far I've got some compost in there. I'm going to add some rock dust and then add some cocoa core and some vermiculite. Mix it up, spread it out, and if I need to make another batch, I'll make another batch.
Okay, I think they are ready to put the plants in and to add the nutrients that goes with each plant. I left a little room on top because I am going to have to put some mulch on top. I got some organic, like, Grow Plus mulch to put on top so it can keep as much of the moisture in as possible. Okay, so there are the plants ready to be transplanted. First one's just going to get compost tea. Second one is getting the Trifecta Plus. And the third one is getting the C90 in the water. So, let's get transplanting. First time you water from above, probably for a little while I'm going to water from above anyway because the roots are not that, that as deep to get the water from the wicking action. Okay, there you go. There are the melons, and we shall see how they do. Uh, next update, we will be transplanting the tomatoes, the red brandywine tomatoes, and doing a similar application, not in the grown's boxes, but something similar to where they each have their own little, I guess, compartment. <laughs> All right, take care. Have a great day.